Greetings, 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 my V family all over the world. This is your chief and welcome to Dubai. Guys, this is week one of Rank Advancement Week 11. It has been unbelievable, as you know, for my social media i'm here in the beautiful amazing city of dubai met up with v partner dave v partner sharfun v partner adli v partner david sharma v partner dave joel v partner kuna jr meyer uh, the avps the v councils the corporate warriors that are all here it's been unbelievable guys it's been crazy uh and it's time for my wednesday message okay i just finished a fantastic session with AVP Brijesh and his all of his leaders who flew in from all over the world to meet me. It was simply unbelievable. Uh, so nice to see the loyal warriors of Japadas Bismarck and Dato Sri Vijay Ishwaran uh, gathered under one roof, guys. Okay, and um, uh, my Instagram live was from Dubai Mall. I hope you enjoyed it. Okay, and now I'm in the beautiful Palace Downtown Hotel recording my Wednesday message. Uh, and uh, Adli posted a picture of me, Dr. Motas, we partner Dr. Motas, we partner uh, Mohanad. And we were talking about 20 years ago, we met in this humble, humble restaurant called Arax in Aldiafa Road. And today we are meeting at the poolside of, um, of the Palace down, Downtown Hotel, the most luxurious hotel. And uh, we are so grateful to Dato Sri Vijay and Japa for creating this platform, this organization, this company, this opportunity. All right, it was so good to see Motas, Mohanad and all the V partners, AVPs. And I've been talking to so many people over the past two, three days. And I remembered these two words, paradigm shift, okay? And I want you to listen very carefully, okay? Whenever I use the word paradigm shift, I used it a lot in my early days of training that your journey into network marketing requires you to have many paradigm shifts, all right? A paradigm shift is a giant shift of mindset, a leap of mindset that changes who you are, creates unbelievable results of what you do, all right? That's what a paradigm shift is. For example, go to work, come back home, go to work, come back home, go to work, come back home, earn a salary, die broke, and suddenly you saw QNet, this unbelievable opportunity of entrepreneurship with network marketing, and you realize that you have an opportunity to be financially free, being a businessman or businesswoman, that's a paradigm shift, okay? A massive paradigm shift from a nobody to a somebody, from a hero to zero, from an IR to a VC, AVP, V partner. All of this requires paradigm shifts. But a lot of people talk about paradigm shifts, mainly about prospects becoming IRs. And I remember making a video a long time ago. I hope you guys remember. Oh, I met V partner Sachin, V partner Kavita also, all right? Big shout out to them. And uh, I realized that a lot of people talk about paradigm shifts from prospect to IR. They fail to understand that the minute you start your journey as an IR, and I'm talking to the new guys and the guys who've been around for a long time, there's also a lot of paradigm shifts that must happen in order for you to reach the pinnacle of success, of max out, of financial freedom, all right? And today I wanna to talk about these paradigm shifts and a few new paradigm shifts that I want you to achieve in your mind, okay? And uh, I want you guys to listen very carefully because who I am today is thanks to Japa and Dato Sri Vijay, all right? Creating those paradigm shifts in me as, as your upline, as your chief, that I am here today as a culmination of many paradigm shifts. Some were easy to achieve and some I struggled and I needed external forces, especially a great mentor like Dato Sri Vijay, to force my mind to get that click, all right? That I have to change the way I think. I have to change the way I look at things. I have to change 
my complete outlook to life because now I'm an entrepreneur and just not a normal human being trying to survive. Okay, guys? And the first paradigm shift that all of you must achieve, especially the newbies who are watching this Wednesday message, is that now you are a businessman and businesswoman. You are no longer employee mentality. You are now business mentality, business ownership mentality. That means... Your success is in your hands. If it is to be, it is up to me. I always say this, the 10 most powerful two-letter words that Dato Sri Vijay taught me. So the first paradigm shift, you have to realize that there's nobody is going to be there to, to monitor you uh, like a boss or like an employer. Now you must take ownership. This is your business, your journey, your dreams. And this requires you to have a paradigm shift of ownership, discipline, commitment, and you have to erase the word excuse or excusitis from your life that you can't blame the world for where you are and how tough your life is and the lack of financial freedom. And now it is up to you. All right. So the fundamental paradigm shift of starting your journey with us in QNET is now you are a business owner. This is your business. You are the CEO. Everything is your problem. You solve it. You overcome it. It requires a high level of initiative on your own. That you can't blame people. You can't wait for people to tell you to do a presentation. You can't wait for people to tell you to focus on your TAT. You got to take ownership. Right? That's the first paradigm shift. The second paradigm shift is that nobody works for you. You're not in a corporate culture. Your downlines are not your employees. They are your partners. You cannot coerce them. You cannot force them. You got to influence them. You got to establish and maintain strong relationships with them. They are not your employees. They are your partners. They are your family. All right. You have a duty and responsibility towards them to help them achieve their dreams and achieve their financial freedom. All right. So you don't be a boss. You be a brother. You be a sister. You be an upline. You be a mentor. You be family. All right. This is a major paradigm shift. All right. The third paradigm shift. All right, is that this business, okay, requires you to walk the talk, all right? You cannot just instruct. You just cannot, you know, like a boss would an employee because that's the mindset you came from. You have to change it. Here, everything is leadership by example. Everything is walking the talk. Everything is monkey see, monkey do. Remember my last Wednesday message, you are the benchmark. So you've got to walk the talk. You can't tell people to do what you're not willing to do. Dato Sri Vijay just addressed the corporate warriors today saying that, all right, you got to walk the talk. Just remember that. Whatever you tell people to do, you have to do it consistently. They must see you do it. They must feel you do it. They must hear you do it, all right? Very, 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 very important, okay? Uh, the next paradigm shift is the definition of wealth. You see, this is important because... We all came from a position of being poor before this business. I, I don't mean poor, no food to eat, but we had broke mentality. All right. And the danger is when you join QNET, even the smallest success can push you into a comfort zone. So you must have the paradigm shift. And I'm planting this seed in your mind today. Success, true success in network marketing, the ultimate destination. And I'm giving you objective measurement is maxing out three tracking centers, whether you take Three years, four years, five years, 10 years, 15 years, doesn't matter. That's the, de the destination. You don't slow down. You don't get distracted. You don't get demotivated. Even if your check right now is 250 a month, even if your check is 5,000 a week, doesn't matter. That's your destination. All right. So your level of commitment, paying the price. All right. You should know at the back of your mind that you need to go all the way to max out of three tracking centers. That's true financial freedom. And I'll explain more details, but that's your ultimate goal. Now, don't panic. Oh, chief, I just signed up. Why are you talking about three tracking center max out? You must have the ultimate destination. How long you get there varies according to every individual. But at least you know that's the ultimate benchmark. That's where you want to be. That's where the V partners are. All right. You understand? Maxing out one tracking center is not enough because it may not be stable. It may not be consistent. You max out three tracking centers, I guarantee you, your 001 will max out forever, guys. All right. So that's your ultimate goal. So that's the definition of success. That's the definition of financial freedom. Now, don't get me wrong. There are many steps to get there. 
So even if you're earning 500 US a week, I'm proud of you. Even if you're earning 250 a month, I'm proud of you. But remember, you don't slow down. You don't stop. You be consistent. You push yourself out of your comfort zone every single freaking day because the new definition of wealth regardless how poor you are before you started network marketing is a max out of three tracking centers, baby, at Blue Diamond Rank. That's the ultimate goal, all right? And we are there with you. Don't worry. Don't be afraid of that goal. Embrace that goal. Dream about it, all right? You will have ups and downs. You will have challenges, but you must have that paradigm shift. That ultimate success in QNET is three tracking centers max out at Blue Diamond, and you can do it. You will do it. You must do it, all right? Just stay on, on the path. Okay, uh, new paradigm shifts, new paradigm shift, okay, is this, right? Always remain a student because in your previous life, you stopped being a student after you left college. Now you start network marketing, you start learning, watching the eight basic building blogs, welcome video, come to VCon, listen to Japa and Dato Sri Vijay, the great ones on YouTube, follow your system of your upline, never stop being a student. This is a paradigm shift you have to lock and keep. Always be a student. Always be a student. Always learn. Keep learning. Keep changing. Keep evolving. You know, guys, studentship is fundamentally important in this journey. I'm still a student today. I'm a proud student of Japa and Dato Sri Vijay. You never stop learning. There's always something new. There's always new evolution that you need to achieve. Right? So paradigm shift. Okay? Now, this next paradigm shift is interesting. Uh, we partner Kavita and I spoke about it. All right? Today, your whole organization is geared to Friday being closing day. So what you do, you do presentation, 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 and you lock everything in on Friday. So Friday is super busy because you are doing all the signups and key in the e-card and credit card and boom, boom, boom. Now, this is the most important paradigm shift of 2022. This is your chief, your upline speaking to you. So look into my eyes. Change that paradigm shift. Right? I want to start a culture, a new paradigm that we do closing on Wednesday. Right? So whatever presentations you have closed on Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday morning, afternoon, you lock it in, key it in on Wednesday. Let me explain why. Because what happens to your mind because of the paradigm shift of closing only on Friday, right? you just chill out until Friday. And Friday, you are too busy processing your signups, right? That you don't have time to do new presentations or focus on follow through or people with questions. So whatever signups you already accumulated on Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, put it into the system, sign them up on Wednesday, all right? They have become an IR after you sign them up. They can do Act 48 on Thursday and Friday. Why wait until Friday for them to become an IR? You basically lock them in on Wednesday, all right? Middle of the week, paradigm shift, sign up day. Imagine that Wednesday is the new Friday, all right? All these people, they can sign up two people on Thursday, Friday from their hot zone. This immediately increases your BV, increases momentum for the following week. So Wednesday is the new Friday. Now, then you have Thursday to do your follow-throughs, close more people. Friday, do your follow-throughs, close more people, and then put in your Friday signups also. So in a week, we only knew Friday as closing. I want to create Wednesday as closing, Friday as closing. So Wednesday is so crucial because everyone you sign up on Wednesday will be able to sign up people from their hot zone on Thursday and Friday. You just increased your sign up, your BV, your checks. The whole craziness of momentum will change. This is one of the most powerful paradigm shifts I spoke to Kavita about. I'm so freaking excited. This is going to be my mantra throughout this year and the whole of next year, okay? Wednesday closing, Friday closing. Wednesday closing, Friday closing. And whoever you close on uh, Wednesday become your downlines and they will sign up new people on Thursday and Friday, guys. So these are the, para the two new paradigm shifts, okay? Right? Never stop being a student. Always learn, 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 learn. And the new, most exciting, unbelievable paradigm shift. Start closing on Wednesday. Wednesday is a new Friday. Friday is a bonus Friday. Right? You just expanded your army of networkers from Wednesday onwards and not only wait on Friday and they will see results. So the weekend is not wasted and it will just change the whole culture and momentum in your organization. So start with this week, this Wednesday, 
You're watching my Wednesday message. Perfect timing to do your closing. Whatever you have captured, close them now. Process them now. And then Friday, close more people with the momentum you created from your downlines on Wednesday. Wow. Unbelievable. It's going gonna, it's gonna to change everything, guys. Closing on Wednesday, closing on Friday. Closing on Wednesday, closing on Friday. This is your chief saying welcome to paradigm shifts. Remember, there's not only paradigm shifts from IR to networker. Once you become a networker, you should have consistent paradigm shifts that evolves you into the greatest networker of Dato Sri Vijay's family. I love you guys. See you in Dubai.